finally made it to Costco. <laughs> hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Costco haul. So I finally made it back. It's seriously been like three months since I actually went in and actually shopped. I would go in for like maybe little things here and there or maybe gas, but that was about it because it has been a complete madhouse at my Costco. It still is, but I really needed some stuff. So let me show you what I picked up. And before I start, I did pick up four huge things of bottled water. It's like a 40 pack of bottled water. So I did pick up four of those as well, but I was not like dragging those puppies in here and throwing them on the counter. <laughs> and then I also did buy that mat at Costco as well on sale for nine bucks if you guys are interested and it's the one that's like really cushiony so when you stand there and do dishes it's cushiony on your feet so it's nice and thick if you guys are interested it is on sale so moving on so i did pick up some of the kirkland bath tissue we always get it there we usually get the um, paper towels there as well, but we still have plenty of those, so we didn't need those. We probably have enough to last for another month. Picked up the Downy Unstoppable Beads because those are on sale as well, if you guys are interested. I love those things. Those things make your clothes smell so good. The same thing with the Dawn Dish Soap. It's on sale right now. Then allergies are in full force right now, so we picked up some of this Allerflow. It's basically the Kirkland brand of Flonase and hopefully that's gonna help with our allergies and that is on sale too i believe so perfect timing just for allergy season then i picked up this harvested for you sprouted pumpkin seeds um says it's with a touch of sea salt good source of magnesium protein zinc iron these are shelled so that's perfect because i do not like the ones that are not shelled to be honest with you um there are the macros for that so it has three net carbs and it's about a fourth a cup for a serving. So I thought that was a good deal. It was like six something, super a good deal. Picked up the Birch Benders Keto Pancakes and I picked those up because that is a much better deal at Costco. If you guys like to have that on hand just for mornings that you really want pancakes but you don't wanna bust out a bunch of ingredients, then that is perfect. And that's perfect too because that's perfect for Celine. Celine likes to eat pancakes and that's super easy peasy for her to throw together, especially if I'm at work. Needed to pick up some almond flour because I am almost 100% out. And if you guys have watched my videos at all, almond flour at Costco is by far the best deal that I have found. Then I did snag some Kirkland Mix Nuts. These were not on sale, but it's a nice snack for everybody if they want a snack. Um, and Oscar really likes the mix nuts. They are just a little bit higher in carbs, so the serving is probably around a fourth a cup. It's 28 grams. Um, and it is around seven total carbs and two sugars. But Oscar doesn't really do keto. He does more of like a low carb version of it. So that is for him to take to work and stuff. I went ahead and snagged some more Parmesan cheese. This one here is the one that I like. I think it tastes the best in my personal opinion. I picked up the kind in that big bag and I didn't care for it near as much as I cared for that one. And then Costco is where I really like to get my peanut butter. This is the organic creamy peanut butter. It's not only a really good price, but it also has, and that is what you wanna look for when you buy peanut butter is just uh, you know when the ingredients say basically peanuts and of course, you know if you can add some salt in there And this kind of peanut butter is made with the Valencia nuts So I didn't know this for a long time But those are the nuts that you want when it comes to peanut butter went ahead and picked up some sour cream because that Daisy sour cream is an exceptionally good deal at Costco I also picked up the Kirkland almond milk. This is obviously the unsweetened original and that is a really really good deal you get 12 one quart boxes of almond milk in there and it's nice because the price is amazing and you don't have to put them in the fridge until you open it so that's perfect picked up some bitchin sauce the chipotle 
flavor. If you guys have not tried that, it is so, so good. There are the macros for that. So it, it does have 1.5 grams of carbs, but one of that is fiber, zero sugar. And then the serving size is two tablespoons and the calories are 90. So you probably really want to measure that out because if you're anything like me, I could totally go overboard on that stuff. It is so good. Then I picked up some Kerrygold butter. That, in my opinion, is the best deal at Costco. Picked up Kirkland's mozzarella cheese because we are going to be preparing some fathead dough and freezing it in my meal prep so that way whoever wants fathead dough pizza, they can just yank out one of those. And I'm going to make them personalized. They can yank out their own personalized uh, fathead dough and just make their own pizza. Super easy peasy. And then I picked up the Lakanto Monk Fruit. This is another amazing deal. I went ahead and picked up two because the last time I went, they did not have this. And so I don't want to take my chances of that again. Um, I went ahead and picked up two so that way I definitely have it in stock in my cabinets. But to me, I think the Monk Fruit tastes the best. And again, it's an amazing deal at Costco. I did pick up some Activia yogurt. That is not keto. If you're keto, don't put that on your list, but my grandbaby loves yogurt, so got that for him. Then I did pick up some chicken thighs, and these are such a really good deal too. I got all these for only less than 10 bucks, and you get six packages there, and in each package, you get four thighs, so I thought that was a great deal. Picked up the organic rice cauliflower that I always get. You get four steamable bags. And don't get me wrong, it is so much cheaper to rice your own cauliflower. And I've been trying to be better about doing that. But sometimes if you need something quick, it's all about the convenience. So I always like to have something convenient on hand for those types of nights. Then I picked up the hard salami. So there are the macros for that. Again, this is just a great snack if somebody needs a snack. And another thing too, if you guys, um, some of you may know this, but if you put these on a paper towel and put them in the microwave, they turn into like salami chips. You can even dip the salami chips into the bitchin' sauce and it is so good. So I picked up these Polish sausages. These are the Teton brand. This is 100% grass-fed beef. There are the macros for those. But as far as hot dogs go, these are really kind of my go-to. They are clean, clean, clean ingredients. In my opinion, these taste really good as well, so. So I went ahead and grabbed the Earthbound Power Greens. I get these all the time when I go there. I think these taste really good. They're great for salads. And I know a lot of you guys ask in my meal prep video sometimes where are your vegetables? Well, a lot of times we'll just do salads as sides. And I picked up the Kirkland Bacon. You get four one pound packages in here. So there are the macros for that. And if you guys haven't tried their bacon, their bacon is really good. Then I picked up the Crepini Egg Thins. I've picked these up before. These are um, the cauliflower, kind of like little cauliflower tortillas. And um, it says zero net carbs, eight calories, keto friendly, dairy free, gluten free, paleo friendly. There are the macros for those. And there are the ingredients. So super clean ingredients as well. And then I almost always pick up the huge three pound brick of Philadelphia cream cheese. And there are some recipes I'm going to be making this week that use cream cheese. So I definitely needed that this week. Then Oscar wanted some of this turkey breast. So we picked up this one because I didn't think the macros on this one were that bad. Um, it's only one carb, zero sugars. The ingredients really probably could be cleaner, so if you're in, an ingredient picker, you may not want to get this one, but as far as the macros go, they fit in the macros, so. Then last but not least, we went ahead and picked up these Tarantino sausages again. These things are amazing, and I've been cooking them in my air fryer, and the air fryer cooks these just right. So I went ahead and picked up more of these. 
Um, we've been out for a while and I have been missing these guys because I love me some sausages. So that is everything that we picked up at Costco. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Um, I didn't even really, to be honest with you, look around Costco that much to see if they had any brand new products or anything like that just because it was still so busy. We went super early and it was still so busy. So I will wait to do that until hopefully it, um, it kind of settles down just a little bit. But for now, I think that's all I have for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate every single one of you guys. And don't forget to go out there and make today even better than yesterday. And I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye. But I don't know why You hit the road But you don't realize I'm on the back when you're wrong I won't think twice when